In this video, I will compare TicTic versus Notion and tell you which of these tools may be best for you and your needs. So first, let's go ahead and cover what they do exactly and who they are for, starting with TicTic. So TicTic is a tool that will basically help you, as it says here, stay organized and creative. Now, a great thing that TicTic offers is a free plan. In the free plan, you will get access to some basic task management tools and some basic calendar tools. But for most advanced features, they have a premium plan, which costs $36 per year, which is not that much. It's about $3 per month. Now, in terms of features, you can add tasks by voice input. You can turn emails into tasks. You have Siri widgets and quick ball. You can set deadlines, set task duration, location reminder and recurring tasks. Now, for example, the recurring task is a premium feature. So many of these that you see here are actually premium features, but it's just a basic task management tool for individuals. Now let's compare this to Notion. So Notion does have a lot more features you can see under product, everything it does here. So they have an integrated AI assistant. You can use it for documents, wikis, so you can centralize your business's knowledge. You can do project management, use it for your calendar, create sites, and they have a bunch of templates. Now you can also just use it for your own personal task management. And Notion has a lot more available features and customizability. They do also have a paid plan, but the free plan is very good for many people. Even if you have a team, the free plan will get you 10 guests. Now, if you really want to take it serious, then you will probably need the unlimited blocks for teams, unlimited file uploads, 30 day page history. And in this plan right here, you can even invite 100 guests. So the plus plan costs $10 per seat per month. Then the business plan is $15 per seat per month. And then they have a custom enterprise plan. And you can add Notion AI, which is basically an AI that will help you with all of your tasks inside of Notion. So this is $8 per member per month annually or $10 per member per month when you bill monthly. So should you use TicTic or Notion? I think Notion is best for teams and actually for most individuals too. Only if you're looking for a simple tool to create a to-do list so you can just write down your tasks and tick them off every day, then tick tick is great. But if you're looking for something with some more advanced features, even in the free plan, then you should go with Notion. Now for Teams, Notion is definitely the clear winner since with TicTic you cannot work together in Teams. Notion also has a lot more integrations with different softwares. Now, if you want to get started with Notion for free, I'll leave a link to this page down in the description. From here, just click get Notion for free, and then you can get started using Notion. If this comparison of TicTic versus Notion was helpful, please consider leaving a like and subscribing to my channel. With that being said, I will see you in the next video.